And hello there everyone, welcome back, I am Bob Mod, and aside from the traitor crow, our enemy for life, we've got everyone back in the group. Even Sarah's back. I see you were able to find the rest of your classmates. Yeah, this is everyone. Mom, I'd like you to introduce you to the love of my life, this is Laura. I'm just glad we made it back at all. It's nice that we found everybody though. Someone didn't make it easy to find them, though. <laughs> Regardless, we wouldn't have been able to make it here if not for you all coming to find us. Thank you. <laughs> and naturally, that goes for you too, Celine. Yeah, yeah, whatever. It's good to see you guys again. Did you miss us? And you still haven't bothered to put on a shirt. The winds must have been on your side. While I'd expected you to come back with your classmates, I didn't think you'd come back with Sarah, too. Not that anything had ever happened to you, of all people. Uh, thanks, I guess. <laughs> Are you trying to flirt with her? <laughs> hmm. Certainly has gotten lively around here. Yeah, you're enough. Well, I'll tell you what. Uh, Reen will, uh, will, will make a sacrifice and let Laura share his bed. <laughs> it sure has. You're looking a lot better, Dad. I'm still a ways from being back to my old self, but I'm finding it a lot easier to walk around. Toval and Captain Claire have kindly been handling both the village's security and correspondence with the other regions, which means I can focus on my health. <laughs> We're not doing anything special, really. Ah, oh, everybody is. Ah. Oh. Ah, oh, there's a great little comic along this line that I, I saw on Twitter. There's just some, you know, it's just a little picture of somebody drawing, and uh, a figure comes up. Hey, that looks really good. And uh, the person drawing is, is, you know, starts starts to kind of deflect. You know, that we're not. It's not anything special type thing. Little little devil and the the angel pop up on their shoulders, right? And the devil's all like, Yeah, your work is crap. It's nothing special. You know, going like that. And the angel like pulls a knife on the little shoulder devil. It's like, No, shut up. We worked really hard at this. For once in your life, you can accept a compliment. And goes back to the person. He's like, oh, thank you. I've been working really hard at this. And I was like, yes, we need more of that. We're just glad that you've been getting better. That's not true at all. You've done so much for us. I don't even know where to begin thanking you. Thank you, Lady Schwarzer. And Reen, I want you to know that we're both so proud of what you've accomplished. What do you mean, accomplished? I'm neutral. It couldn't have been easy coming this far, but you did it. You should hold your head high. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. There we are. Oh, I wouldn't have been able to do any of that. Ah! It was only possible because everyone was with me. He almost accepted it without deflection. <laughs> well, I think we've been standing out here long enough. I've had rooms prepared for you all at the Phoenix Wing, so go ahead and rest there. Oh, nice. Isn't that where we stayed during our last visit? That's the one. I imagine you must all be exhausted after all that's transpired. In the Hot Springs times? The open air bath's finally been repaired too. Yeah. If you get the chance, you should enjoy a nice relaxing bath after all your hard work. Damn right I will. Trans Cold Steel 2. Ooh. Let's save. Thank you. Continue. Thus, they left for the Phoenix Wings to recover from the exhaustion that had built up over the past few days. Which kind of stayed the building largely to themselves and relaxing dinner and soaking the springs. The following afternoon, they returned to the rooms to sleep. <laughs> well, presumably, Reen's staying at his home. Ah, the spring! Nope, there he is. Oh, the snow falling. Oh, I remember being in a hot spring in just such a, such a situation. So peaceful tonight. She's probably fast asleep by now. Or tap apart in different ways. Oh, different things on our minds. They're finally back together to class. Nearly getting this far. We have one less thing to worry about now. 
And I would all to at least support encouragement. It's thanks to her that I've been able to make it this far. Hang in there, Elise! I'll bring you and Princess Alfin back safely, I promise. When I do, I should thank you again for giving me all I needed to come as far as I have. Let's sit down and discuss what we're going to do from here on out, too. Can we figure out something like that out by tomorrow? Got to bring at least some ideas to the table. But what? Yeah, a lot to decide about our future. Something we need to decide on as a team. Aww. To their own challenges to face and problems to conquer. And face what they were given head on. Part. But no one lost hope. So everyone tried to make the best of the circumstances they were dealt. Ah, uh, thinking back in our reunions. And the one who left the strongest impression on me was... Oh. Oh! Well, here's the fun thing. We did just get a save point. So I'm going to try and make a point of going through all of these and then taking Laura as the last one. So let's start from the top. We'll work our way down. We'll skip Laura and save her for last. Because, of course, Laura's going to be the one the strong suppression. Mm. It would have been Lisa. She blamed herself more than anyone about how we parted ways in Trista. See how worried she was for me. Now I'm sure she's worried about her mother and the Brineford company. She's still putting everyone else first, just like she always does. She did all she could to bring us together again. Unless it's going to give me, you know, I can start to scroll through them right away. She could be like her. She could be that strong. Rain, are you there? Oh! Uh, Elisa. Oh, she's blushing. I didn't think anyone else would come here so late at night. Sorry, I'll get out now. There's no need to shout. I, um, I actually already knew that you were here. Ooh. I asked the manager beforehand. Well now. So I thought now might be a good time to talk with you. Um, pardon? Oh, Reen, you irresistible man, you. There's really nothing like a warm bath on a cold winter's day. Gazing up at the night sky, feeling the warmth of the spring coursing through your whole body. This is such bliss. Uh, yeah, I couldn't agree <laughs> more. It, it's my favorite time of year to relax in the springs, too. But both of us bathing in here together is really, really not a good idea. I know. Who knows what could happen? Why, she's probably already pregnant. Doesn't it bother you even a little? The two of us here alone feels kind of... Wow, Reen. I don't know. Wow. Just... Man, it's your friend. What's the big deal? I'm covered up, aren't I? Yes, she is. You've seen her wear less the swim class. I'd appreciate it if you didn't stare so hard, though. I might have managed to pluck up the courage to come in here, but it's still kind of embarrassing. Aw, oh, they're such teenagers. Well... I... Japanese-written teenagers. Enough. Anime-ridden teenagers! But what made you need to pluck up the courage to come in here to begin with? You said you wanted to talk. Anything in particular? Well... Yeah, There's that demon um, scar of his. I just wanted to thank you. Thank me? Thank me for what? I don't feel like I've done anything that warrants being thanked. You have, though. And for everything, really. I wanted to thank you for surviving all this time so that we could meet again. And I wanted to thank you for coming all the way to Nord to get me. Aww. Maybe we can't be here with Crow, but because of you, the rest of us are back together again. Because of me? That's not true. Besides, it was only because of you guys that I was able to Aww. do anything at all. <laughs> I knew you'd say we that. We all knew he'd say that. Still, I feel like Class 7 is what it is because you're at its center. We had faith that you get back up on your feet and fight. And it's because you followed through that we've come this far. I'm not the only one who feels that way either. So, thank you, Reen. I... Take the compliment. Oh, <laughs> uh, you broke him. Oh, come on! Knock it off with the laughing! It wasn't easy to come here and say all of this, you know. <laughs> I'm sorry. I wasn't laughing at you. Normally, I'm the one who gives that speech. It just finally hit home that 
everything Elise said was true. I had no idea that everyone was thinking of me as much as they were, or that so many people were looking out for me. It just made me realize all over again how blind I've been all this time. So I couldn't help but laugh at myself. <laughs> well, I can accept that. And now that you know, I don't want you to ever forget it. We've been through so much together, Reen. We have a bond so strong, nothing can ever break it. Don't worry. I won't forget. And now that Class 7 is together again, I'm sure we'll be able to go back to the Academy one day. As long as we don't give up, I know we can make that a reality. So, let's give it everything we've got. Of course. That's nice. I have to admit, um, if they hadn't have started off Elisa with her whole, Oh, we bumped into each other, and then I fell on, I, I fell on your face, and I'm going to be grumpy forever at you about that, I would probably have liked her more as a character. Ooh, like experience. Neat. Time passes. Yeah, rest day. Number three. The Phoenix Wings here until this afternoon. Plenty of time to figure out what we can do beforehand. There's more on their minds, too. Alright, so your basic yeah, bonding points time. Ooh, Laura, Emma, Yusuf, Sarah, all have two bonding points. Luckily, I've got all the points! And also, luckily, load game! Turbo mode through this. There we are. Yes, it was definitely Elliot who made the strongest impression on me. He's been worried sick about his dad and Fiona, but he never let that stop him once. He's probably still worried too, but now we have no idea where Fiona is. And yet he's never let it show once. His smile's better than ever. I wish I could be like him. I wish I could be that strong. How's the water, Reen? Eh, not bad. Oh, hey. You know what? I didn't think anyone would be swinging by this late. I'm li I like that they do it for both both sides. They both do the slow pan up. I regardless of the gender. I fast asleep by now. Well, I heard you leaving your room, so I figured I'd follow and see what's up. Got room for one more? <laughs> of course. Come on in. <laughs> ah, nothing beats bathing in a hot spring while looking up at the sky during winter. I love that tingly feeling from all the warmth coming back to my fingers. <laughs> This is my favorite season to use the springs, too. Still, any particular reason you wanted to take another bath? I mean, I know it's nice, and it's not like I can talk, but we were all in here earlier today. Oh, I just thought this might be a good chance to say something that I've been meaning to say for a while. I'd like to thank you, Reen. Oh, this is the Everybody Loves Reen chapter. I don't feel like I've done anything that warrants being thanked. Well... Everything, really. I wanted to thank you for surviving all this time so that we could meet again. And I wanted to thank you for coming all the way to Celtic to get us. It's sad that Crow's not here, but you're the reason the rest of us are together again. They're way more into Crow than I would be in their case. I don't know, what do you think? Is this interesting Crow a little, a little too much? I, I am? I wouldn't be so sure. It was only thanks to everyone's support, yours included, that I was able to do anything at all. That's true too, I guess. 
Still, I feel like Class 7 is what it is because you're at its center. We knew you'd stand right back up and fight. And because you did just that, we're here, fighting by your side. And I'm sure everyone else feels the same exact way. Or well, at least, we know Elisa does. So, thank you, Reen. I... He's gonna laugh at himself too? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Sorry. That was all super cheesy, <laughs> huh? It was a little. You don't need to laugh that much, though. <laughs> I'm sorry. It just finally hit. I had no idea that everyone was thinking. It yep. just made me realize all over. So I couldn't help. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay. That was line for line the same th as well, before. Now you know. We're friends, and our bond is stronger than you know. I hope you never forget that. I know I won't. Oh. Don't worry. I won't either. And now that Class 7 is together again, I'm sure we'll be able to go back to the Academy one day. As long as we don't give up, I know we can make that a reality. So, let's give it everything we've got. Right. Some little little differences. Nothing major. I'm still curious to see everybody's little part. Go. System load. Wee. Wee. All right. It was definitely Machius. I thought about this a little bit. Definitely Machius. Unquestioned. So you know he could over to Celt to find us using lost contacts. He had to make it a reality. Yeah, it was. It was it was a good little kind of taking second command type thing. Capital's occupied. No idea where his father was. Stay responsible as ever. He doubles efforts alongside Elliot and Fee. She could be like him. She could be that strong. It's me, Reen. I'm coming in. Oh, hey. I didn't think anyone would be swing. I figured everyone would be fast asleep by now. Well, I noticed you leaving your room, so I thought I'd tag along and see what's up. Mind if I join you? Where's your glasses? Sure. Go right ahead. Ah, there really is nothing like soaking in a hot spring under a wintry sky. You can feel all of your exhaustion just melting away. <laughs> this is my favorite season to use the springs, too. I do like how they change it just a little for each of the characters. Still, what made you want to come back in here? I mean, I know it's nice and... It... Oh, I just thought this might be a good chance to talk to you, that's all. Or more specifically, I thought this would be an ideal opportunity to say thank you. You're thanking me? I don't feel like I've done anything. Well, everything up to this point, I guess. I wanted to thank you for surviving all this. And I wanted to thank you for coming all the way to Kel. I feel like it was only thanks to you that all of us were able to come together. Mmm, get the crow. Thanks to me? That's not true. <laughs> In a way, you're right. Still, Class 7 is what we believed you'd stand back up again and fight. Mm. I know I feel that way, and I'm sure that everyone else does too. So, please, I... Oh. It's pretty identical. <laughs> That's pretty similar. Hey, I'll admit that may be an overdramatic way of putting it, but I don't think you're in any position to criticize. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. It just finally hit home. I had no idea that everyone was thinking of me. It just made me re so I couldn't help. Oh, right. Well, as long as you understand now, we didn't become friends overnight, but since then, we've all formed a bond that won't be so easily broken. Don't forget that. Don't worry. I won't. And now that Class 7 is together again, as long as we don't give up. So, let's get right. All right. Mm -hmm. Ooh, leveled up. Level 4. Anger and cover. What? Mm -hmm. still, I want to see them all. And I am the one in control of the game. Hmm. 
Yeah. Tell me about Emma. The Emma. It's time she's been fighting alone, unable to tell any of us her true identity as a witch. And why she was doing what she did. It's been hard on her. Did she feel like an outsider? She liked never being able to ask for our support. She could to fulfill her duties as a witch while being a loyal and kind classmate to us. She could be like her. If she could be that strong! Rain? Oh yeah, I forget how much hair. She's She's got a lot of hair. Uh, Emma? I didn't think anyone else would come here so late at night. Sorry, I'll get out now. No, no. You shouldn't have to do that. I'm so sorry. I had no idea that anyone was in here. Oh, that's different. Still, this might be the perfect chance for us to sit down and talk. Elisa definitely came out because he was in here. And hers was its own kind of coincidence. Interesting. Well, that's a little more different. I like that. A little change. Ah, uh, it, um, it feels wonderful to bathe here during the winter. Small talk! Yay. I love the feeling of warmth coursing through your entire body while relaxing. Y yeah, I couldn't agree more. It's my favorite time of the year to relax in the springs, too. Don't stare at her chest, Reen. Don't stare at her chest. But never mind that. Uh, are, are you sure you're comfortable with both of us being here, Emma? It's kind of a... I, uh... I see what you mean. Still, I'm modestly covered, so I don't think it's too much of a problem. Uh, I'd appreciate although I can't blame you too much. I'm the one who decided to come in to begin with. Uh, oh. Are all the girls going to tell him not to stare? I wonder. I wasn't doing it on purpose. Sorry. Anyway, you said you want Was it about anything in particular? Yes, as it so happens. Thank me? I don't feel like it. <laughs> well, every I wanted to thank you for surviving. Mm -hmm. I wanted to thank you for coming. Crow may not be with us, but eh. you're the reason the rest of us are together again. Get with the crow. I think that's a bit of a. Besides, it was only because. Of oh, that's so sweet of you to say. Everyone contributed something in some way. However, I believe Class Seven can only. We all believed you would get back on your feet and fight. I feel that way, and I know everyone else does too. So, thank you, Reen. I. Now he'll laugh and he'll laugh. <laughs> uh, please don't laugh. Yeah, Reen, don't laugh. That's me. It took a lot of courage to come in here and tell you that, you know. Yeah. <laughs> it just fine. I had no idea. It just made me real, so I couldn't. <laughs> I see. Our bonds are stronger than you. I hope you. Don't worry. Now that Class Seven is together, as long as we don't, so let's give it up. Of course. All right. Next. Ooh, level three. Auto Curia, powerful strike. Mm. I'm gonna do one more, and then I'm probably gonna take a small break. Diddly -do 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 -do. Mm. All right, no, no, no. Me and Eusis were the best of buds, two nobles, brothers in arms. We had that romantic duel. Eusis belongs to the four great houses, and he had to use that position to search for our whereabouts instead. Poor and his father and brother are in the noble alliance. That couldn't have been an easy decision for him. He was never willing to compromise his sense of responsibility and tried to find his own path to believe in instead. Oh, she could be like him. She could be that strong. You seem to be quite comfortable having the whole spring to yourself. Oh, hey. I didn't think anyone would- I figured everyone would be- I might have been, but I noticed you leaving your room, so I thought I'd see what you were up to. Would you mind if I joined you? Sure, go right ahead. So some of them- some of them figured out that he was leaving, some potentially looked for him. <sighs> the some feeling of relaxing in a hot spring during winter truly is indescribable. 
the warmth that spreads through your body is oddly comforting. <laughs> this is my favorite season to use this. Still, I mean, I know it's nice. I thought that this might be a good opportunity to talk to you. I'd like to thank you, Reen. Thank me? I don't feel- For everything that has happened and thank you for surviving all this. And thank you for risking everything by traveling into one of the noble faction's largest strongholds to find me. Aww. The crow may not be with us. Again with the crow! all thanks to you. Thanks? That's not- I can see why you'd feel that way. Still, I believe class- We all believed you would- I know I'm not the only- So- I- <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure laughing is the most appropriate reaction, especially since you're always the one making us listen to those ridiculously florid <laughs> speeches with a straight face. It's true. <laughs> it just fine. I had no idea. It just made me realize so I c I see. Know this. The bonds forged between us will not be broken easily. I hope you'll never forget that. Don't worry. I would not All right. so All right, so that'll be the last one. We'll, uh, we'll do the others next time, so thank you all for watching. Please uh, share your thoughts, your comments. I love to read them. You know I do. Um, like and subscribe if you've enjoyed. And, of course, if you're feeling generous, you can always support me on Patreon or follow me on Twitter. But otherwise, I want to see you all later. Have a good night.